Okay guys, today we are going to discuss about slope and deflection for statically determinate beams. A statically determinate beams is said to be determinate when a beam is going to analyze by using three equilibrium conditions. First we are going to discuss about slope, shape of the slope and shape of the deflection for a cantilever beam. A cantilever beam is one side is fixed, other end is free, it is called a cantilever. And this beam is going to analyze by using only three equilibrium conditions. This beam is initially straight. This beam is initially straight. There is no load acting on this beam. And when the load is acting at the free end, the same beam is going to deflect in a circular arc shape. This is a circular arc shape and this is called elastic curve. The other way is called deflected shape of a deflected shape. And next, a slope is an angle between tangent drawn on this axis of the beam and to the draw elastic curve, draw tangent on this elastic curve. See, this is the tangent drawn on this elastic curve and is going to meet the axis of the beam. Slope is the angle between the tangent drawn on this elastic curve and to the axis of the beam. And next draw tangent on this elastic curve at A. This is the elastic curve drawn on this elastic curve. All the elastic curve at A is parallel to the axis of the beam. So there is no slope at the fixed support. And there is no deflection at the fixed support because of its rigidity. And due to fixity, there will be no deflection. And there will be no slope because the tangent, tangent drawn on this elastic curve is parallel to the axis of the beam. And this is about slope and coming to deflection. Deflection is a vertical displacement between axis of the beam and to the elastic curve. This is the deflection. Deflection is a vertical displacement between this elastic curve and to the axis of the beam. This is about slope and deflection of a cantilever beam. Now we are going to discuss about the shape of a slope and deflection of a simply supported beam. This is a simply supported beam. When a beam is resting on the two supports, it is called a simply supported beam. And this beam is initially free free from loading, so the shape of this beam is straight. After the application of this loading, the simply supported beam is going to bend in circular arc shape, as shown in here. This is called deflected shape of a beam, the other way is called as an elastic curve. And draw tangent on this elastic curve at A, and draw tangent on the elastic curve at B, and draw tangent on this elastic curve at midpoint. Ma, this is a C. And this is the slope at A. It's theta A stands for slope at A. It is a tangent drawn on the elastic curve at A and to the axis of the beam, it's a slope at A. And the slope at B, the tangent drawn on the elastic curve at support B and to the axis of the beam, it's called slope at B. And now tangent drawn on the elastic curve at the center is parallel to the axis of the beam, so there will be no slope. For a simply supported beam, the slope is maximum at the left support and at the right support. For coming to simply supported beam, there is a deflection. There will be no deflection at the right support and there is no deflection at left support and deflection is maximum at the center, as shown here. This is the deflection of a simply supported beam and this is the deflection of cantilever beam. Thank you guys.